Hello guys, welcome to Miss T's Tarot. We will be doing a pick a card reading today. Um, what doors will be opening up for you? Um, pile number one is the black crystal. Pile two is the green crystal. And pile three is the yellow crystal. Um, what doors will be opening up for you next? I'll give you a moment to take a look at the pals. Pick the pal that you're most drawn to and then we'll get started. I'd like to thank all you guys for watching my channel, liking, sharing, and subscribing. Don't forget to hit the like button. As many times as y'all like the video, the video just circle, uh, circles around where other people can see it, where I'll be able to help others with these encouraging, enlightenment words that I'm telling you all from the messages that I'm getting from spirits. So don't forget to hit the like button. Okay, we'll get started with pal number... Um, Pound number one, on what doors are opening up next for you, pound number one. I see you got a lover coming here, pound number one. A romantic lover, somebody may be even want to propose to you soon. That door is opening up for you. Love is opening up. The door to love is opening up for pound number one. It could be somebody coming back from your childhood. First of all, I want to say with that lover's card, this person could be a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces here. Uh, somebody from your childhood could be returning here. Or somebody you dated in the past, or some somebody's returning from your past. This could also be a um, Capricorn here. That's um, coming coming back from your past here. Could also be a Scorpio that's coming back. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and uh, Scorpio is here. So what I see for you guys, pal number one, on um, um, the next door that's opening up for you guys is love here. It could be somebody returning from your past here. Um, Watch out here because I don't know if this is the person that's returning from your past, but it's a lot of jealousy. Um, it's a lot of jealousy and envy here with this devil card, Capricorn card here. But yeah, you are, uh, this could be somebody that's trying to return here from your past. Like I said, somebody you broke up with, ended this um, relationship with here. But the next door that's also coming open for you guys is uh, your money going to be improving a lot. Wishes going to be fulfilled. You're going to be able to live a luxurious life of uh, buying and having everything you want here. So watch out. It's going to be, if this not the person that's returning with this envy and jealousy, then you have some people, maybe family, friends, or somebody that's going to be jealous of how you, you know, your lifestyle. This is the next door that's opening up for you is this nine of cups for us financial wise. Your life is going to be better. You're going to be happier here. You, it's a lot of jealous and envy around here with this um uh, devil card. So you may need to, um you know, try to watch yourself. When it comes down to family, friends, and past relationships, because you're going to have a lot of people that's going to envy this nine of cups that you got here. And you're going to need to cut ties with some of these people here because uh, you don't want to be giving, you know, good things out to bad people here. So your door is opening up next. You're going to have wish fulfillments here. You got a new love that's coming in here or somebody's returning from your past is going to ask you to be in a, a serious relationship, possibly marriage. Let's see what else we have here. The next door opening up for you is healing and happiness. Like I said, you can heal from these things that have hurt you or you are healing from these things that hurt you from the past. But don't allow these people 
to come back into your life here because you are having wish fulfillments that's coming for your next door opening up here. And this is a door that's also opening up to more heal, more healing and happiness. And the door to spirit is opening up. It's already open to help you, you know, um, through your hard times with your on your healing journey here. So the door to spirit is already open here helping you in this healing process. So you may need to cut ties and leave these ties, you know, cut with people, whether it's family, friends, exes, or whatever here, because with all you got coming here with this nine of cups, like I said, you don't want to be passing this out, just giving it to people that don't deserve this here. Like I said, deceit is coming along with this nine of cups. You are going to get it. You are healing here. Spirit is here for you here. The next, the door to, to all this abundance that you got coming, you're going to be looked at as a privileged lady here. Having everything you want here, living a luxurious life. You're going to be looking beautiful here. And there's a lot of deceit around. So use your discernment here when it comes down to that because... You have put an end to some situations, old relationships, and you may need to be looking into more, looking into cutting off some more people here because, like I said, your blessings, your door to more blessings is coming. You're going to be living a comfortable life. People are going to be looking at you as somebody very beautiful, somebody very privileged here. <clears throat> the door that next door could be opening up, you could be having a child here also. Getting married, a lover is coming, and a child is coming here. Yep, it's some concern here. Uh, you could be very concerned about, you know, the people around you here. Uh, maybe you've been, you know, thinking a lot about, you know, the, the real people that you have in your life. Um the real people that really love you or, you know, just use your discernment because it is some deceit around you and it's going to be coming more. That's this is what the cards are saying because the door of the spirit is here. It's already opening up doors for you. Your spirit team is God, your ancestors, um, spirit guides. So it's here, but they are warning you that um, you need to be concerned Maybe the people, you know, just use your discernment here. Power number uh, one. So these are the things that's coming in for you. Your next door that's coming, that's going to open up for you. Getting married. Meeting somebody that want to be married. You know, um, having a child here. A lot of abundance is here. You know, people going to be looking at you like you're very privileged. And, you know, they're going to feel like that you ought to share this abundance with them. But just use your discernment here. So this is all I have for you guys, pile number one. We will be moving on to pile number two. Don't forget to like this video and just make it circulate so other people can watch the video so I'm able to help other people, encourage other people to enlighten them while we're on this spiritual journey. Okay, we'll move on to power number two now. Power number two is the green crystal on the next door that's opening up for you here. The door to strength is going to be opening up for you uh, here power number two you're going to be getting a lot stronger here because i see that some of you guys been in your head a whole lot you've been worried about a whole lot of things here and it's kind of stressful you're going to have the strength you know to push through this to get through everything that's been having you down your anxiety your fears here god is going to be giving you a lot more strength here you know peace of mind here you know, helping you with your anxiety, you know, your depression about things or the way of life here. Yep, you're going to get balances coming into your life here. Things are going to be getting balanced out, whether it's in money and love, whatever this is, family problems. Balance is coming for you and Spirit is asking you to be patient here. So things are going to be working out to help balance you out here. Uh, you're going to be getting the strength, you know, to get through all this, your fears and anxieties here. 
You also have a door where a romance is coming in. Take this, whether uh, how it resonates, male or female, somebody very loving, somebody intuitive here, smart, um, you know, uh, loving, caring, just like you. You got somebody that's coming in. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces that's uh, coming in here. But Spirit wants you to know that you're going to be happy here. You're going to have the happy life, family. Uh, everything's going to work out for you. You're going to have the money that you need here to stop worrying. They are here to help you get through this. Your spirit guides, angels, ancestors, God is here to bring balance into your life, to give you the strength to keep going, to not give up here. Uh, maybe you've been worried about, are you going to get married? Are you going to be in a relationship? Yep, yeah, you do have one coming. It's going to be a king of cups, somebody very loving, compassionate, understanding here. Somebody that's very intuitive. They're going to already know what you need here. Well, with these doors opening up for you, pal number two, it's going to be some hostilities from people here. But no worries because you're going to be happy, successful, satisfied with how the doors that God are opening up for you. Just get your strength back, pick your head up, and try to keep going as much as possible because your balance is on the way here. You just got to be patient here. Hostilities are going to come up when they find out that you got this new love that's coming in here and all the happiness here with this sun card. Um, yeah, hostilities going to come up. Happy family card is here again. So you're going to be smiling, have a happy family life. A lot of wish fulfillment is going to come for you, but you just got to be patient and try to push through all of this to get your strength back, to stay encouraged. Yep, spirits want you to detach yourself from this energy here. Try to, uh, you know, watch powerful, I mean, a positive things, listen, uh, say your affirmations. Do your protection baths, uh, use sage if you have to, you know, protect your energy. You know, try to be as cheerful as you can here. Spirit wants you to detach from this low energy here so he can send these blessings into you for this new love that you're looking, that you've been wanting. So you can, uh, you know, to receive all the abundance of everything you want because you got the sun card here. And the uh, happy family card here. That's a lot of abundance, a happy family here, a happy life here. Let's see what else we have. Yep, somebody is really thinking about you, and I feel like it's this king or queen of cups. Take it as it resonates for you guys. Because um, it's a lady in a picture back here, and it's a man thinking about her. It could be vice versa. Take it as it resonates. Um but somebody's really thinking about, you know, they want to have a life with you. You know, they want to be in a relationship, a loving, caring relationship with you. So this man or woman is thinking about you a lot. Maybe they have your picture. Maybe they see you on social media. But this person is coming in, truly wants love here. So your love is coming in. This person is already thinking about you. Like I said, courtship with the king of cups. This picture of the man and woman thinking about each other. Somebody's thinking about courting you, wanting to date you. They want to be in a loving, caring relationship here. Y'all could even get married, go to the courthouse here. But there's some things here wants you to um, detach yourself from this low energy. Try to work on this, guys, as much as you can. You know, I know I realize things could get hard sometimes. Do your prayers, your affirmations, you know, sage. Um, use your protection like um, whatever you use, uh, spiritual baths or whatever you need to do, you know, to help get your energy back. Stay focused. Uh, listen to positive things here. This is the only thing I see that, you know, it's kind of like you all in your head and you feeling low here and God is giving you the next door is going to open up for you is you're going to have more strength here. You're going to get out of your head here so that you will be ready to accept these things that you asking God for. So this is all I have for power number two, you guys. Don't forget to hit the like button, like, share, and subscribe. 
if you can just uh <clears throat> hit the like button it just make the video float around so other viewers can see and i can help you know to be an encouragement enlightenment into others lives as well as yours so now we're about to move on to pile number three on um, what door is opening up for you next pile number three pile number three let's see You might be turning your back on a job that you already have or business or something. You're really thinking about your future a lot here. This is the door is opening up for you. More opportunities here is coming your way. You got to make it look like you're making a decision to plan what's best for your life here. You're going to be doing a lot of planning here. What's best for your life, your future here. Power number um, three. Yep, you're going to be, you, let's see what about this one, let's see. Yep, more money opportunities going to be coming in for you. Uh, you know, this is the door that's going to open up for you, uh, power number three. You may decide to leave a job here or do something different in your career as far as planning for your finances, but your money, whatever decision or whatever door you decide to, uh, that's coming for you, you know, I know you're thinking a lot about your future here, but your money is definitely going to improve here. Maybe you're going to need to walk away or you will be walking away here. This door that you leave in one door, opening up another door for more money opportunities here. You're going to have several options that you'll be able to choose from. It's going to be several doors that's going to be opening up for you because you are really thinking about um, planning for your future, maybe doing something different, doing a different type of work or different type of career here. But you will, this door is going to be open to you. You're going to have many options here. you somebody very smart, intelligent, um, standing firm, you're going to stand firm on the word, what you believe in as far as your future here. you somebody that's not going to give up on what you want here. So, you know, you somebody that's uh, very intelligent and very demanding, and you're going to push through this. So you're going to make you're gonna make a decision to walk through the next door here, which is uh, your finances are going to be improving here. Yep, you somebody very smart, ambitious, very outspoken. You get what you want, and you're going to demand, you know, to have the type of pay raise that you want here. So that's why your finance is going to be improving here. Whatever job you decide or business, you somebody very smart and intelligent. You already know what you want. You're going to fight hard for it. You're going to go for it. Ain't nobody going to stop you from going for what you want. This is the queen of swords. Nobody stops you. You already smart, intelligent. Take it as a resonate male or female. You are you're a smart, determined person. You're not going to give up on what you want here. And things are going to happen for you. You're going to have many options here. Doors are all type of doors are going to be open to you. You're just going to have to make a choice. Like I said, you've been undecisive about which way to go. Should you leave this job or what should you do here? But you got to make a decision to take one of these doors. You see these signs on here? You got to make a decision which way to go, which door to take, because you got a lot of options that's going to be coming in. You're going to have a lot of options in romance. So it is somebody that's going to be coming in that wants to love on you, want to be in a relationship here. Take it as it resonates, male or female. Love is coming in. This is the next door that's going to be opening up for you. Uh, I feel like this door is going to be closed here. To the broken heart maybe you had your heart broken before but it's a new love that's coming in that really truly wants love here if you are still involved in a relationship at this time and it's heartbreaking uh you got to remove yourself from this situation here no matter how many years or how long y'all been together whether it's children involved or not uh, I feel like this, this relationship that you're probably in now um, is very heartbreaking. You know, you're probably just in it 
you know, just because you've been in this relationship. But Spirit wants you to close this door here from this person that's been breaking your heart. Because a new romance is coming in. This is the new door that's opening up for you. So you got to close out this old cycle with this person that's breaking your heart, male or female. Take it as it resonates. But you do have a new love that's coming in. Many opportunities in love, uh, you know, career-wise here. You got many options here. Yep, you're going to be getting married. So Spirit is asking you to close this door to this heartbroken, heartbreaking, um, you know, um, relationship that you in now and be open because the door to romance is here it's a door is just like the um title is the door to romance is opening up next for you here and a marriage is gonna come out of that like i say you've been working really hard that's why you've been planning for your future with this two of ones on what decision to make like i said you've been working really hard and there's some new doors that's opening up here and you're going to have many more options here and your money will be improving but you're going to need to um it's, it looks like you have turned your back already, pretty much made up your mind here. So Spirit is asking that you walk right into what, you know, what you're planning here. You won't have to work so hard. You've been working so hard and maybe you're not, you're not getting enough money here. But with that four of because your money is getting ready to uh, improve. You got a daughter romance. Love is coming for you guys here, pal number three. This is a message of concern. Um, I don't know. Let's see. I don't know if this has something to do with this um, this relationship that you in. Uh, maybe you already broke up from this person because this person broke your heart here. Maybe they keep reaching out to you. Uh, telling you problems or acting like something is wrong with them. They may could be sending you messages or calling you here and trying to have you very concerned about, you know, they won't let go here. I feel like this is the person that broke your heart. Maybe you already left this person or maybe y'all still live together and this person know that you're on the verge of uh, planning for your future just like with the two of wands this could also mean love as well you you deciding to walk away from this it's not working anymore whether it's a job or in love and maybe you already left or you told this person you're gonna leave and they know you're leaving you walking away from it so they they may be sending you messages calling you telling you this telling you that how much they love you or they could be just making up stories like they sick or something is wrong but spirit is calling for you to close this door because you got love that's coming somebody wants to marry you here you will not be working so hard if you change your mind on these um career um career things that you've been doing here or love past love or love just not working out you got love and marriage and career is going to be doing very well here so you have a lot of decisions to make but these doors are opening up for you pal number three love and better career opportunities here so I would like to thank all you guys for watching Miss T's Tarot don't forget to hit the like button here like share and subscribe and don't forget to hit the like button because it helps the video to circle around the internet so that other people can watch the videos, you know, so I can be of help to anybody that need it. Um, that's all. So hit the like button and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.